Ozarks on the Ozark CW starts now. Good evening, I'm Rob Macko. An old movie theater is getting some new life in downtown Springfield. What used to be the Hollywood Theaters is undergoing some major renovations and will reopen with a new name. Francis Watson joins us live to talk about the details on this exciting redevelopment. Francis. Yeah, Rob, this theater's been closed for about two years now, and though you can't see it from here, Paul, owner Paul Tillman tells me there's a lot happening behind the scenes with the major state-of-the-art upgrades. He says he hopes to be open in time for the Gladiator movie being released this fall. I am very surprised. Christian Banks and Gabriel Price say they thought the old Hollywood theater in downtown Springfield would remain closed. It's building vacant. I was expecting it not to be reopened, as most other buildings usually are here in Springfield. I was expecting them not to reopen, though. I was because they closed. I'm pretty sure that I was told they closed due to bankruptcy. And Regal did. The company dimmed the lights in the theater for good in 2023 after the parent company, Cineworld Group, declared Chapter 11 bankruptcy in September of 2022. I just remember, like, just the nostalgia. It was definitely been a minute since I was up there. Last time I went, I think, was when I was 13. Christian and Gabriel will soon be able to enjoy a blockbuster movie once the rebranded College Station Theaters opens this fall. Tillman Redevelopment LLC, owners of the property, decided not to sell or lease it but resurrect the shuttered movie house complete with upgrades including new sound systems projectors and even heated reclining seats they're shooting for a late november opening we're so excited to see anything happening with it haley magnus with it's all downtown says the corner of campbell and college has slowly been coming to life she says renovating the old theater will boost the economic profile of the downtown district between the Blue Room Comedy Club bringing in incredible new acts, uh, we just had a new restaurant open there, Mama G's Kitchen, which is fantastic. So really all of that working alongside the reopening of this theater just makes that a really great place to hang out. Christian and Gabriel say they can't wait to buy their tickets. It's really convenient that I could just literally walk 10, 15 minutes from my place to a theater. Now, next month, we'll see the old sign replaced with a new sign, giving us our first look at the new, th new and improved, rather, theater. Reporting live in downtown Springfield, I'm Francis Watson. All right, exciting stuff.